After the martyrdom of Imam Hussein, peace be upon him, the Imam had a little daughter that was three years old named Ruqayya. This little girl was very attached to her father and would cry day and night due to her separation from him. They would tell her that he's gone away on a journey, meaning the journey of the afterlife. When Ahl al-Bayt, peace be upon them, were placed in the ruins of Damascus by Yazid the Cursed, Ruqayya, peace be upon her, fell asleep and saw Imam Hussein in her dream. She woke up startled and crying. She found her beloved father missing and found herself a captive for Yazid, son of Muawiyah. May Allah curse him. Where is my father? Right now I just saw him. Bring me my father. I want my father. What are these noises that have deprived me from my sweet sleep? One of Hussein's daughters saw her father in her dream, so she woke up crying, asking for him. Woe unto you! Take her her father's head and place it in front of her, so that she can be comforted by it. <laughs> food or drinks. I want my father. This is your father's head. Father, oh father, who covers your beard with blood? Father, oh father, who beheaded you? Father, oh father, who made me an orphan at such a young age? Father, oh father, who will be there for the young girl until she grows old? Oh father, who will be there for the imprisoned widows? Oh father, who will be there for the weeping eyes? Oh father, who will be there for the lost and strange woman? Oh father, who do we have after you? Oh father, who do we have after you? Oh father, I wish I was blind before today. Oh father, I wish I was sleeping in my grave and I don't see your beard covered with blood. And Zainab, lift the orphan off my father's head, for she has passed away. 